intended for Steve Smith is batted away by Darrell Revis. What a fabulous year Revis is having, his third year out of pit. Certainly among the top two or three cornerbacks in the entire National Football League. Oh, he's he's gifted. There's no question about it. And you heard John Fox talking about it, just how much respect they had for him. Play clock down to five. Intercepted. It looked like it hit a receiver in the back. Darrell Revis will go the distance for a touchdown. Clearly missed the communication between DeLome and the intended receiver, Steve Smith. It appeared to hit him in the foot and ricocheted right into the arms of Revis. How about that? Well, with the no huddle, you're going to see Steve Smith come out of it right here. Obviously, Jake DeLome thought that Steve was going to turn and look at him very quickly. What are the odds it bounces up off his foot and into the hands of Darrell Rivas? Third interception of the season by Rivas. His first touchdown. Carnage in motion. Play fake to Stewart. DeLome rolls. What a catch made on the far sideline by Steve Smith. He'll be three yards short of the first down, but how in the world did he bring that in and keep both feet in bounds? This is just a typical boot or waggle play, and the guy here, uh, Steve Smith on the outside, runs basically a deep comeback. He is the last option for Jake DeLone. Wow, what just a one-handed grab. Basically saved the play to now put them in a third and short. Carolina gets a football from its own 20-yard line. Four and a half minutes to play until halftime, and the Panthers are trailing 7-3. to three. Lucien Mohamed in motion. Play fake to Stewart. And looking for Steve Smith. And there again is Darrell Revis. His second interception on the afternoon. This guy is just a stud. I mean, whether you're talking about covering Andre Johnson, whether you're talking about Marcus Colston a couple of times against Randy Moss, he just gets it done. I want you to watch how quickly he transitioned, turns his hips, and plays the ball, and still can keep pace with Steve, Met, uh, Steve Smith. That, that, is a, that is a beautiful play. Jake knew... You don't want to challenge this guy too often, but you can't stay away from your best player, Steve Smith. That's just a beautiful transition into coverage and then intercepting the ball by Darrell Rivas. Again, once again, when they need to throw the ball, they're spreading it out into no back. The long to the end zone. Smith caught it, both feet in, touchdown Steve Smith. He beat Revis in the corner. There's not much a defender can do about that play. No, and this is the brilliance of a Steve Smith. Darrell Revis, as good as there is in the game, but you got to give Steve Smith his due. You give me enough shots. Now you can just see the isolation down here on the bottom. This is a phenomenal, great throw by Jake DeLome. Can be thrown only one place. That's just great hand-eye coordination. Great control. Looks like New York is going to challenge it. The question is, did he have control all the way down? Looks like it may have bobbled a little bit as he was going out of bounds. This looks, on first look, as though it might be a very smart challenge by Rex Ryan. Remember the elements. You obviously have to come down. The Jets coaching staff is challenging the rule on the field of a completed catch for a touchdown. Well, we're going to see the challenge. After the play, is an incomplete pass. The receiver did not gain possession of the football until he landed out of bounds. And we're going to see clearly on the, on the replay here, as he comes down again, you have to have control to the ground, and you're going to see as he brings it in. It's a phenomenal catch either way. But right here, you can see that flash of white. The minute they saw the laces come out, the officials... Uh, are on the we're, we're looking at the replay knew that he did not have control through the entire catch it's a good call 
That's fine. going to be pressure here at some point. He can't just sit and play zone too long. Here comes that blitz. And alone. Throws it into the air, had an eye on Steve Smith. Kerry Rhodes put a hit on DeLone just as he turned it loose. Max Ryan's Jets get a win to go to five and six. John Fox's Panthers slip to four and seven.